Hello guys, my name is Maria. On this video, I will show you how to add an outline on your images using Canva for free. It's a pretty easy procedure actually, it doesn't take much of time, so if you're ready, let's go and see it. Um, before we get started, just make sure that you use an image with a transparent background. In order to do this, if you use Canva Pro, you can click on the object you want to use, click on Effects, and then the background remover. But if you use the free version of uh, Canva, you can, re uh, you can uh, visit remove.bg. This is a very handy tool to remove the background from any image. So you can upload the image you want to edit uh, and it re uh, removes the background for you automatically. So you can download and upload it again here on Canva free of charge. Just make sure that the background color doesn't match the object uh, color because uh, then the result will be very accurate. So once you do this, and you have this as a final result, in order to proceed with the outline, you just hit the object, duplicate it, and then you click here on Effects. And from Duotone, this is the effect that we will use for this uh, trick, uh, we click and select any, uh, any, any tone. Uh, I just use the cherry, but you can use any, it doesn't make a difference. As you can see here, the color changed. So in order to make it uh, blank or uh, any other color, we click here, the settings, and we remove the, the highlights and the shadow as well. Or we can change the color if we want to have it black instead of uh, white. And we hit on apply. Sometimes you need to do it again and again because it's a bit buggy. But uh, try to have it like that. And uh, after that, you, you scale it a little just to make sure that uh, 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 it's covered. As you can see here, it's a bit buggy, but uh, this is the procedure you follow. After you finish, you just click on position and Backwards, you set it on the back. And as you can see here, I have the outline where I can center my object and I can play a little uh, with uh, the shadow. I can make it bigger or smaller, depending on what I want to fix and center it. And this is it, actually. Once uh, finished, you can click on download and you will have your image ready to use. Don't forget to uh, to remove the, the background as well. And if you use the Canva Pro, you can download the transparent, uh, you can uh, hit on download and uh, have the transparent background as well. Click here on the transparent background. If you don't, you can leave it like that and uh, visit remove.bg in order to remove for the black or blue background and you can leave the shadow at the back. This is it. I hope you found it helpful. Uh, in case you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like or share uh, this video with your friends and make sure to click on subscribe if you want to follow more content creation tips. Thank you very much for watching. See you later.